Greetings soil and water conservation fans. This is Betty McCracken. I work for Monacan Soil and Water Conservation District as a conservation specialist. I'm out on a field visit today looking at a newly installed stream exclusion system. Soil and water conservation districts administer a program called the Virginia Agricultural Cost Share Program. It's available to eligible farmers to put in best management practices on their farm. And as, as I stated earlier, one of the practices is stream exclusion. We help farmers design a system to fence their cattle out of the stream. That improves water quality in a number of ways. And then they put in these frost-free water troughs that do not freeze in the winter uh, only if we have an ice storm uh, would they freeze but there is a tube under the trough that runs that allows the pipe to come up through and the heat from the ground keeps the water from freezing in the winter time so the water, water is warm in the winter it keeps it cool in the summertime the cows learn to push the balls down to drink to get a sip of water cattle drink we average a cow-calf pair to drink 20 gallons of water a day, so these water troughs have to provide enough water for the number of cattle on the farm. And the balls help to um, keep algae from growing inside the trough. They block out sunlight, as you can see. There are some troughs, that, this is a richy water trough, there are some troughs where the balls actually are stick up over top of the hole so you can see the balls floating so you can make sure that water is in the trough. This is, a, this is one style of water trough that's available to farmers, but I thought you would be interested in seeing what it looks like and how farming has advanced and how cows can, they're kind of smart too, they can um, learn to push the balls down pretty quickly and the calves too. So this is a conservation conversation that I wanted to include you with while I was out on this field visit today. Thank you. I'll be talking to you soon.